Well, increasingly, there are a number of athletes that are dissatisfied with their carb loading and high carb diets, and just not, uh, you know, getting the benefit that um, is generally thought to occur with with uh, copious amounts of sugar and carbs, which we've been told is ideal for athletes. And so, uh, it's it's been really interesting to. Uh, observe a lot of endurance athletes in particular switching to a low carbohydrate often ketogenic diet with not just uh, you know average results in terms of being able to exercise there are some athletes that are actually winning races and setting national records in various endurance events so clearly we've overemphasized the importance of carbohydrate for optimal performance now not to say a ketogenic diet's right for all athletes, but there are a lot of reasons why a, a, a ketogenic diet that enhances fat burning would benefit athletes, especially endurance athletes. But what we've learned in the clinical literature and some of the basic science coming out about ketones is that they're very potent at protecting against oxidative stress and decreasing inflammation. And these are important physiologic processes for athletes too because when you exercise that's oxidative stress that's an inflammatory stimulus and if you don't counteract that with your recovery abilities then you can have maladaptations to training and so one of the perceived benefits of athletes on these ketogenic diets is they recover remarkably fast it allows them to tolerate higher volumes of training they just enjoy their exercise more so there's a lot of merit to enhancing your in ability to burn fat for fuel and ketones for fuel in terms of promoting health, promoting performance, performing, uh, um, enhancing resiliency, your just ability to cope with various stressors. So this is a real exciting area that definitely needs more attention, but um, the early research and the testimonials and case studies out there are just remarkable. It's hard to ignore.